Am I colorblind or what? I look like the flag from a foreign country no one's even heard of. Come in. Hi. I brought over Senator Wickman's voting re record. Wow. Somebody's got a big date or spring cleaning is in <laughs> full bloom. Oh, well, since my idea of spring cleaning is taking out the trash, I'm afraid what you're looking at is a serious wardrobe crisis. Oh, who's the lucky guy? I don't know how lucky he is going on a date with Miss Fashion Faux Pas, but he is the most generous and mature guy I've ever met. Really? And, if you can believe it, he even held the door open for me. Lois, that's great. You deserve nothing less than a true gentleman. Does he have a name? Graham, as in the cracker. Oh, the same Graham who sent Clark the extravagant thank you gift. I told you he was generous. Okay, so the THX care package was maybe a bit over the top, but Clark did save his life. And for whatever reason, Clark wants nothing to do with him. What gives you that idea? Well, he threw a party for Clark last night, another attempt to say thank you, and the man of honor came and went in less than five minutes. Graham felt terrible. Well, tell Graham not to take it personally. I just don't think Clark's in a mood to celebrate these days. No. I'm definitely not an expert on this, but if you ask me, I think he needs to finish the chapter on Lana, turn the page, start dating again. Well, Clark's always gone at his own pace on these things, and I doubt this will be any different. Here, try this. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Let's see. Now, put this. Uh, try this underneath it. <laughs> Oh, oh, that's nice. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty. Yeah. You know, if I had a mom around, I'd have learned to dress myself a long time ago. You're doing great, Lois. In fact, if, if I'd had a daughter, I'd want her to be just like you.